Okay, so here's another quick video. I'll show you guys some stuff that I picked up, and uh, this is kind of crazy right here. Got this for 19 bucks. What it essentially is, it's large cast iron, which I love cast iron personally. If you're not cooking with cast iron, you're missing out. It's the only thing to cook with. So usually I pick these up at different places, but uh, I was going through Wally World, needed something for the police interceptor Crown Vic I picked up. So saw this on the shelf, $19, blowing it out. How can you not get that? So now let's check this guy out. What's, I'm going to show you what's cool about this thing for 19 bucks. Let's see here. U.S. made. They're not like polished out, but you can take your sander and you get this, and you can polish this guy out if you wanted to. I'm not too worried about it, but what one of the things I was looking for is I was looking for something that I could actually utilize when I'm on the road or I'm camping or whatever, and this glass is perfect for that. So let's check this out. Let's get this box the hell out of here. And for 19 bucks, how can you go wrong? So essentially, what you're getting is you're getting two pans. You're getting a top lid lodge and then you're getting this big guy on the bottom which is kind of a fryer and then your instructions that'll be going in the fire so rust don't panic tells you how to season it tells you how to lid glass lids are safe up to 400 degrees this one's safe way farther than that but you can tell this is a perfect like fry pan look at this and i didn't have one i have this guy up here that you can see that's uh but it's got uh the grills in it whatever you want to call them the griddles so that i can actually utilize and then i have a bunch more cast iron kind of a collector of cast iron but what's badass about this one is i can use this for frying chicken whatever i can use this for making breakfast with and then bam i can turn that around and you got like a mini i already have a dutch oven but this that's like a mini dutch oven so check that out so when i'm out traveling around I could take two pans with me and basically cover all my cooking needs. I got a deep fryer, I got a skillet, and then I got a Dutch oven. So that covers everything I need to, and then they stack on top of each other. Look like they're good to go. I don't know why they were selling them so cheap. They're, it was like a clearance deal, I guess. Usually their pans are a little more expensive than that, but they're not out of the ballpark expensive. So that's kind of badass. Look good. I like them. And they nestle perfectly, so when I finish building my camp trailer and my stealth camper, I can take these along with me. And uh, this is all I need, two pans. And then I got my uh, stove that I actually did a video on that you guys can check out. And that allows you to have two pans that cover the majority of your needs, plus your stove so you can cook on there. Or you can cook over the open fire with these. The only thing that you're not able to do, like with a Dutch oven, is it actually stands out of the fire. So you'd have to spin this out of the fire a little bit. That's easy to do with rocks or whatever. And then you could still stack some coals on top if you were using utilizing it as a Dutch oven. So I like it. I think it's good to go. You could actually make a hinge where you could keep them together, but that'd defeat the purpose of the actual two pans. But like with most lodge stuff, it looks like it's well made. It's already pre-seasoned, which is kind of horseshit. You gotta re-season these things the proper way. I have another video where you guys can check that out, how to season these with high quality oil. Flaxseed oil is about the best that you can do these with. And then they make different uh, oils that you can use. Still got to do a reserve. You can see Whiskey Rivers has gone dry on the Four Roses bourbon. Awesome. And then I found this new tequila, the Avion Silver. And usually I don't like silver. I've drank a lot of tequila, but uh, this is awesome stuff. A little pricey. But not too bad. The Four Roses is about 26 bucks, I would want to say. But it's top notch bourbon. The Avion, uh, I think I want to, I want to say I paid 39 bucks for this, 40 bucks for this, but totally worth it. You can actually get the smaller ones too. And it's a three pack. It, it has the silver, and then it has, um, oh god, I get the Respato, and then the top shelf stuff, which I can't remember the name of. Then, this is something else I want to show you guys. I'm going to just compact it all into this one video because I'm kind of pressed for time. But this is something you guys need to pick up. What this is, is a TDS EC and temperature meter. And this is how you test your water. So, I'm on a well, personally. And I'm going to check my water because 
the water comes out a weird color and I think it's the pipes and um, that's something that's gonna have to be addressed at another date but pick this up because I'm gonna show you I got another thing on the way that I'm gonna do a video on and I'm gonna show you guys that and why exactly I got this thing but this test up from total dissolved solids from 0 to 990 parts per million and your water is essential so you need to make sure that you are drinking decent quality water I'm also going to probably do a review on some of the bottled waters and show the different dissolved solids in those and uh, a way to purify those. So, what else we get in here? I've got a couple of other little things. Oh, I got pumps. So, at one point in time I picked up these uh, Aero Gardens, which you can see these things are pricey. got some herbs drying and growing my own herbs. But, um... These things are pretty pricey. I mean, they're like 200 bucks. I got two of them, luckily, at a thrift store for 25 bucks a piece. How can you beat that? But the pumps went out, so no big deal. Got on old Amazon, which bezels is a piece of shit, but that's another that's another video. Got these pumps. They're ceramic. They're made specifically for the Aero Garden. Two pumps. Each pump 12.95. So I'm in my Aero Gardens for 30 bucks, I guess. 35 bucks a piece, 30, 37 a piece, whatever you want to call it, 40 bucks. So two of them for 80 bucks, how can you beat that? Alrighty, tell me what you think, like and subscribe, tell me what other videos you want to see, and I got to go back to work. Bye!